Just wondering, you know, are there any specific uh, policy priorities um, that you had not been able to do, you know, given the situation in Albany previously and the previous governor that you think can get done now or will be after next Tuesday? Yeah. Uh, Aaron, I mean, look, uh, first of all, there's some great things I think we can do. Uh, if the legislature comes back, we're not sure what their timeline is. Um, but it'll, I think, be a whole new day in terms of having uh, just an honest, substantive conversation about what's going to help New Yorkers as opposed to all the games uh, that we saw with the previous governor. Uh, right now, uh, we have pieces of legislation that passed the legislature, like the vouchers bill related to getting homeless folks to affordable housing. Um, you know, we had no idea what the outgoing governor was going to do with that. It's a really important piece of legislation. The city has acted. The state legislature has acted. Here's an example of something we could do constructively together, city and state all on the same page. This is the kind of thing I'm hopeful that we can do with soon-to-be Governor Hochul. Uh, I think there's a lot of areas uh, where we'll be able to work together in a new way. So good question. We'll be saying a lot more uh, as uh, different uh, pieces emerge. But I absolutely am feeling urgency to look at the things that were never possible before and now see if we can find that common ground and move forward uh, over these next few months. And I, I think the incoming governor is open to that. Next, we have Alice from CB24. 